I could be happy with two stat level ups in this game because they're, you know, growth rates in this game aren't as good as in other games. All right, Toby Poo. I'd rather actually you get hit than uh, Claire, so you can stand there. And Claire is fine now. Hooray. And these two cannot reach anyone. Actually, you can reach you. Yay, good. Pegasi exist. Oh, yeah, witches can teleport anywhere and attack anyone. Because that's fair. Although I have actually noticed their AI is actually kind of bad. Thoughts on Castile and Leon? My nick nickname for Leon? Oh, I, I love Leon. He's freaking awesome. He's probably my favorite archer of the game, actually. I mean, there's only him and Python by default, I guess. <laughs> but, I d uh, including Tobin, too, I guess. I liked him more than when Tobin was an archer as well. Wait, this game has growth rates? <laughs> it tries. You guys watching? You guys watching? You saw that? You he was asking for watching. I hope you guys saw that. He wanted to, you guys, he's, you wanted to see that. There's some interesting looking witches. They look like Metopia imps, but better. Oh, but taller. Okay. Leon first time was meh. Uh, maybe I just desperately needed archer, more archers in uh, Celica's route, and he was the only one. <laughs> oh, what the? Python cannot double her? Really? What is your speed? Six. Oh, okay. Can you double her? No. You're poopy. Gray, I guess gray. No, not gray. How about you, uh, Claire? You can double. That works. You won't kill him, though. Have ever used Atlas as an archer? I've only played through the game fully once. No, and no, the only I used Ar I use Atlas as a uh, Myrmidon, Dreadfighter. But just because I needed I needed more of them because you can never get enough of them. I'm watching more than just your battle cliff. <laughs> wow. You're poopy. <laughs> I had to use Atlas as an archer by request. Attack and speed. Oh, nice, Python. That's a really good level up. Atlas is best in Archer. That's actually what I'm planning to make him in this game. Spoiler alert. Um, that is what I plan to make uh, Atlas when we get to him. Let's Excalibur this guy. Excalibur! I was hoping for a crit, but all right. There are 26 natures in Pokemon, right? I don't know the number offhand. Uh, Lucas, you kill this dude now. I missed Atlas. Well, no. You missed. Oh, you like you didn't get him entire. I completely missed Jesse in my playthrough, my first playthrough. I didn't even know he exists. I I completely forgot to go in the little uh, fort that he's captured in. I'll make sure to get him this time. Um, yeah, the, I, the, basically after you beat the level he's in, like some stuff happens in the map, and I'm like, oh cool, what happened? And I completely forgot to go in the fort. Atlas, the Titan that held the Earth. Excalibur, Excalibur. Oh yeah, I said okay. Uh, you're gonna lightning sword this dude. Oh, uh, you just barely won't kill him. That's fine. Jesse is okay. That's what I, that's what I hear. I, I plan to get him, because, I mean, why would I not get him? I just don't know if he's gonna stay as that, or if he's gonna get left behind. I can do this. Uh, I guess no one can hit that guy. I guess, Gray, you can, Cliff, I mean, yeah, Cliff, you can just finish him off. Atlas is clearly the best mage in the game. I hear he's good as a mage, too. To be honest, I think Atlas is good as anything. It just depends on what your pre preference is at that moment. Um, what the heck, Um? Seriously? Oh, seriously? Does this guy just have ridiculously high defense? I guess he is a knight, but... Foresight though is just fine! I thought Alm was like the best unit! Okay, whatever. You kill him. You kill him, Forsyth. Ella's is also a nuclear mage, but Archer is his best class. Okay. Saber was best Merc for me. My best uh, mercenary was actually uh, Kamui in my first playthrough. But, eh. Right? I, I don't know who's in it. It's, it could be just, you know, different level ups that people get. So who knows? It'll be this time. You Silk to kill. I did, could Silk have reached? I didn't know if Silk could. Whatever. Let's heal. Oh, and then start keep walking up. I forgot Silk was a unit. But Silk is good. I like Silk. She's definitely probably the worst of all the clerics in the game, but she is she's decent. Oh, that's bad. You're going for Lucas. Ow. 
Ow. That was actually that was bad. That could have been a crit, and I could have died. And Fernand's group is now approaching. Great. I feel like I'd be the only one here who's not afraid to have my clerics also some fighting. He has some frightening power to her. Oh yeah, there no, there's nothing wrong with that, but it, like if there's nothing else to kill, and at the moment it's better for someone else to kill things. Um I'm gonna definitely just prefer Um You know, just uh, other units take care of it and then they heal. Jenny was up for the least useful character. Really? Jenny? That's weird. Jenny was like my best one. Well, actually, maybe Tatiana. But Jenny, I guess Jenny was kind of like the only cleric on Sel Selica's route, though. So I don't know. Maybe she was just good by default. Rip. And yeah, Jenny's fantastic. I agree. Speed. Clive, you suck! I guess speed is okay stat to get up here if you're just gonna get one stat. But still. But still. And what the heck, Lucas? I guess I'll heal you with silk. That's fine. Even though it doesn't heal you all the way, though. Uh, you should be fine. Taddy was the best cleric when I got her. Yeah, she she was probably, just in, re in retrospect. Uh, we're going to put all these guys in the front lines. They can, they'll be fine. These guys are all good. These guys are all good units. They can all take hits and do stuff. Um, we're going to actually physic Lucas the rest of the way. And then Toby Poo, you will stand right here and just, you know, look pretty, I guess. And then uh, Alm, you will stand here, and you're going to take a hit from the knight, because I know you can. You'll be just fine. You'll be okay. Trust me. Tati healed the least amount of HP. She did? I don't know. Tati's the only cleric who learned Rewarp, though, right? I did, never used it, personally. I probably should use more spells like that, but I only ever used Healing and Physic and uh, Conjure. Or summon, whatever the spell is called. Invoke, that's it. Their models look like they'd be an anime dating simulator, the way they are drawn. Funny you say that, because... Awakening and Fates are generally uh, criticized as being just that. Dating simulators. I don't see them as that, but they can be if you want them to be. <laughs> I think I'll take my leave now. Goodbye, everyone. I always remember Leon is gay, and that's all they ever thought for of him. But hey, there's nothing wrong with that. But yes, he most certainly is. Uh oh, come at me, bros. Really? All right, true nobleman, take this. <laughs> this game was drawn by a top-tier mangaka. Mangaka. Okay. Toby Poo, attack. Scalabur. Oh, this guy's a javelin! I didn't notice that! <laughs> I think we'll be fine. Critical, 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 come on! Come on, 31% critical! Come on! Oh, come on, Cliff! Tobin, whoever you are. Tobin. Fernand's bedroom eyes! <laughs> yeah, Toby Poo, that's his name! To that's what Tobin is short for, don't you know anything? That's his name! Gray confirms it! When he's talking to him. Uh, maybe we have a problem. No one else can reach them. Uh, Clivey Clive, can you do a heavy shot? Yeah, that should be good. Do that, and then Alm can finish him off. <laughs> Looks like Toby is poo. <laughs> he's being poo right now. Oh, actually, you finish it off, Claire. Stab! Goodbye! <laughs> Clive, Clive. No, I will not surrender. Not like I won't surrender. I will. Uh, okay, you're not surrendering. <laughs> you're surrendered yet? He can't speak. I'm assuming he has it. Stay. Okay. And oh, um, I guess you can kill a regular unit. May I? Stabs. <laughs> Yeah, um, thanks for showing us how it's done. You totally needed to do that. Thanks. Silky Silk. <laughs> okay, guys, we get it. Pretty sure I only I only see Clive as that as a Clivey Clive. I don't see any other characters as a something something. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. 
look at Miguel. Yo, yeah. Okay, Forsyth, be a Forsyth to be reckoned with. Alm looks really young. He's supposed to be 18, I believe. So yeah, he's he's decently young. Not like super young, but decently young compared to other characters in the game. I must fall back and rejoin Lord Berkuf in the main force. I'm I cannot die because I have plot armor. Bye. Thought it was 15. Really? I thought 18. I wouldn't be surprised if he was. 15 in the original, like, Japanese version, but they made him 18 in this game, just in the English translation, just because difference in culture, you know? That's my guess. Uh... Oh, I thought it was almost 17. Close enough. 17 18, basically, you're, you're the same thing. So this game is a fi 50, 50 times multi multiplier to critical chance when the enemy is at 2 HP. I know! Uh, you are not kidding. You are not kidding. They're definitely the case. He'd be younger than Roy and Leaf. Interesting. Well, I never played either. I have not played either of the games those two people are from. And, yeah, that's a Lucas level up. Two things. Usually not very helpful things. Alright, now we just have this Arcanist. Um, he's probably actually going to go for Foresight now that I'm looking at this. Uh, that might not be good. But what can we do? He'd actually be kind of stupid to go for either these two people because they're they have ridiculously high resistance. So feel free to go for my healers if you'd like. Just got Jolly Marshadow. My wonderful battle that was perfect. Oh, cool! I got a Marshadow. I think it was just yesterday. A uh, uh, Pip. He gave me a spare code that he had, or Lucas. Um, so that was very nice of him. Uh, I didn't look at its nature, though. I didn't actually care about using it at all. I was like, oh, cool. Got a Mars Shadow now. That'll go in my box and rot forever. <laughs> but still. I love how the finishing blow for knights just ramming the guy to their shield. I know, that's so cool. The paladins uh, and uh, gold knights sometimes kick with their horses, which I also think is a nice touch as well. It's very cool that my Geo came and I gave to you, AB. Yes, that's the full story. Some of his names look like they came from a random fantasy name generator. I mean, hey, what what number file of game is this? Oh wait, it was number two. It was a remake of number two, wasn't it? I was gonna say maybe they're running out of names and they had to use one of those, but <laughs> no, this was not, this was the second one of the series. Just this is the remake. <laughs> Don't push me. Play nice. <laughs> All right, that was, we've got one map done, guys. Good job. This was fun. I got the code that expires when the day changes. Interesting. <laughs> Man, that was too easy. Great, that was easy. Okay. I kind of thought that was easy, to be honest. That like there were no like too difficult moments there. That was fun. We've emerged victorious, but the survivors will be making their way back to the main force. Survivor. Can't rest on our Just now. Fernand. Just Didn't Fernand. Greek life? Uh, yes. Huh? Oh, sorry. I was just thinking about how you might not actually be who you say you are, Alm. Oh, right. Forgive me. You and Fernand were good As well the best mage in FE history, no, though. 100% critical in a second attack when well, using the special not tome. just that. In any case, it's nothing Never heard you of him. trouble yourself with. If you'll excuse me. What's with him? Who knows? It's not like we, the player, has have heard every conversation. Laurels? I don't know what a laurel is. Uh, Alright, Celica's turn! Da da da! Ah, the lightning sword. The sword I had on wheel all the way until I got the better sword, after being failing to say, yes! I've mentioned this in the playthrough so far on Blue Gritty Gaming, but that battle after. The battle with the say the second time is my least favorite part of the game, story wise. Map wise, I, I don't mind it at all, but. In terms of story-wise, my least favorite part. The bad route? What, this is the bad route? Clive, why is, how is Clive edgy? Well, give the little girl a prize. You're pretty smart for a foreign lass. <laughs> You're pretty smart for being foreign. <laughs> Imagine if that was said in America and they gave a specific race instead of just said foreign. 
Wait, was, was that Garth? Barth or Garth? Wait. Garth. He has the same portrait as Barth. Garth and Barth. <laughs> How did I know was that the first time I played? <laughs> That's actually quite funny. Alright, uh... Alright, so this this map I don't really like, because you have to split your army in two, and one side gets three people, the other gets five. Um, I'm going to put uh, you over here. Uh, and one of the one of the Myrmidons. Who is more defensive? You are equal in defense. But, Saber, you have more resistance, so Saber. Is there any magic people even over here? No, there's not a single magic person on this map, so it was redundant, but still. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. Let's do this! Oh my. Kata is better. Dried bananas. Ooh, Leon has purple hair. Yeah, he's the gay one. <laughs> he's, or he's the fabulous one. And he's legitimately an awesome character. Like, no no joke. In my opinion, at least. Um, ah! What are you... I don't like that. All right, um, so yeah, we have to be very careful with this map, um, because like, look at this. We start off like how many, like one, two, like five spaces away from like the whole group. It's just kind of like an onslaught, and there's just this little bridge separating us. So I could let them come to us, I guess, um, or I could wall them with, you know, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna start by putting Conway on the bridge. Boop. Leon, you're gonna shoot the boss. Uh, you're gonna use curve shot just because. Leon should meet Wallace. Who are you? Uh, Garth and Barth for Smash Bros. Five. <laughs> Obviously the best of Fire Emblem characters, and totally would be, would be the best to put in the game. And they can work like the ice climbers. <laughs> Skill and luck. Okay. All right. Oh, you guys can talk. Well, I guess, what else are you good for, Bowie, besides talking with May? Uh, Alright, so you are going to stand here, and then May, you're going to stand here and talk to Bowie, and then you're going to attack. He has no butt armor. Um, May? Excuse me? Huh? Oh, hey, Bowie. What's shaking? What's shaking? Do you not want to fight? If this is too painful for you, you can just say so. He's fab. I like really? him. <laughs> I'm glad. This is great. Let his family is an independent woman who don't need no man, except Valbar. Uh, he needs Valbar. No, he, he... See, wait, no, I don't. If that's how you... But then I didn't really use Valbar in my first playthrough, and I used Leon a lot, so... I just said what I was thinking. The toy! ...to be fighting actual real-life people, that's all. I'm surprised to be murdering people. Well, whatever. Well, now I feel like an idiot for worrying about you! feeling bad about killing people. I guess you're okay with it. All right. <sighs> Who's Valbar? This guy. Leave it to me. Leave it to me. He's the deep-voiced, uh, really powerful pirate guy. Oh. Not pirate guy. He, he's the pi slayer of pirates. And I'm going to have you stand here for healing. Uh, and Celica, you... You can, I guess, uh... Actually, yeah, no, black magic, you can... I guess you that. This will make him run away, probably. Is that boob armor or just red coconut shells? Because those are almost perfectly round. <laughs> Think of them what you will. Ancient Iron Man. <laughs> Maze Perkin is somewhat contagious, always put me in a good mood for some reason. I agree. I I think May is my favorite character of this whole game. I think. I, I might have to think about it more. I might have a different answer by the, by the end, but she's my go-to response if someone asks me. So. Yes, because people say Dodoy in a high fantasy setting. <laughs> Tink! Stab! Tink! Yeah, Valbar will just wall that whole, well, point. But yeah, uh, the, actually, the silly part of this map is actually these two Pegasus Knights. Because they will attack things recklessly, and if they die, we don't get to recruit them. 
So, kind of like in the chapter we recruited Valbar, Leon, and uh, Kamui. Luckily, Paula has a javelin, so she'll usually attack from afar. But Katri does not. She does not. She does not. Uh, how can I do this? How can I do this? I wanted to heal you. Oh, and I can do that. Stab you with my stabby stab spear spear. Stabby stabby. Or shield bash. That works too. How's that? Great, right? So, sir, Valbar sounds like a mix between Her Hercules Satan from ABZ and John Goodman. All right. All right I'm going to maybe heal Katri at any chance I get. All right, Saber, kill this guy now, or at least try it. Palo will probably finish him off and steal your experience. That's all right. Sure, I'm still hyper. Well, let's go. Yeah, that, yeah that's what, how she says that. A nice level up, Saber. Nice. Very, very nice. Okay. Uh, now for this group. Um, did they even move? Oh, I know what they did. They used the archer to attack these guys, which was a mistake. All right, um, Bowie, do pretend you're helping. Actually, do you even need to do that, or can May kill him without you doing that? May can kill him without you doing that, so don't bother. Actually, I didn't use thunder. I could have used fire, couldn't I? Oh, well. Too late now. Are you sure you aren't Kuzco from Emperor's New Groove? I'm fairly certain. I don't think I'm that egocentric. I guess feel free to tell me if I'm wrong. <laughs> yeah, good job, May. You got some dried meat. Uh, all right. Uh, Leonardo, attack this archer. Actually, don't. That will do like nothing. Uh, fireball this archer. Felica. Thunder, rain, and lightning. Miss. Fireballs, yum. We got the pirate. Pirates dried meat. <laughs> Are yeah, literally, because you raised skill. <laughs> okay. All right, come. We now kill this guy. With your blast sword that explodes with feathers. Feathers everywhere for some reason. Stabby, stabby, spear, spear. Sounds like something Kuzco says. Oh, okay. I get it. I understand. I understand the reference now. Uh, how could someone hit the attack that spot? Oh, because this guy can walk on the water. Um, so in that case, I guess Leon stand there, because I don't trust Bowie to stand there. Uh, use arts to attack uh, the mercenary, because he's probably been the hardest person to kill. And Bowie, can you attack him without getting in danger? Uh, you get anything from that guy? He's probably not. He's he probably won't be a huge deal. So let's thunder this guy. Boom! We try to make him run away. Oh look at Jesus! Huh? Oh, walking water. I get it. Walking water will they make wine for you? And yeah, see here's my boy Sun. He gets doubled because he's a slow defensive mage, which makes no sense. It annoys me that we don't get a single axe user in this game. I don't mind it because the weapon triangle doesn't exist. Um, but I understand what you mean. I, it, is, it, it is a little silly, but at the same time, they're really unnecessary because no weapon triangle. Alright, and yeah, they're just going to keep attacking Kamui, I guess. I don't know why. I wonder if made her say that whenever she gets a skill level up. Probably. I'd stay, but school exists, so bye, y'all. No, it doesn't. School is just a myth. But whatever. Thank you for coming anyway. Hope you enjoyed your time here. And they are both going for Katria. Shocker! Shocker, they're going for the weak Pegasus Knight, who's just hanging out. Now, everyone has to rush over there, but chances are they're not going to be able to get over there fast enough. Because, yeah. Oh, Pala's going for this one. All right, that's fine. Go for that one. Thanks, Pala. Maybe help your sister over there? Uh, no. Okay, fine. She'll just keep getting attacked, I guess. 
I would like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> Oh, yes, I nearly forgot. In school is a fairy tale. Time to sleep early for no reason, then. All right. Fair enough. Thanks for coming. Hope you enjoyed. All right. Thunder! Bowie, do something. Pretend. Pre at least pretend. Yay! You pretended. Thank you. I appreciate that. And actually, that literally was helpful. So thank you, Bowie. I don't think you needed to be the one to kill him, but... Man, you, you got two stats that level up, dude. Two stats. I'm impressed. Two whole stats. And I, I'm not kidding. I am legitimately impressed that he got two whole stats. All right, um, stand here. Oh, we're going to use Stabby Stabby, which, oh, 5% crit. Oh, you only do three damage if you get a crit. Um, I don't like it. This mercenary is, like, difficult. I wonder if Jenny should attack him. What, what could Jenny do if she attacks? Eh, it's not worth it. Just heal. You just keep healing Katria, just, so, just to decrease her chances of dying. Yay! Three damage! <laughs> Alright, Leon, uh, kill this guy as you're walking away. All cool guy-like. We'll do a good curve shot just because you can. I have to create the layout for a pre preschool classroom, and neither of my partners have helped me much. I did most of the work. Wow, shocker! A group project where the other group members don't do much work? Wow, I've never had that before. I feel like it would annoy me if I play any Fire Emblem game, but why do they get axes and you don't? If the triangle thing isn't a thing, then why do they get axes? Pfft, these axes are only used by bandits, obviously! Axes aren't used by civilized warriors, they're only used by brigands and other, you know, bandits and pirates and stuff. That's the lore of Fire Emblem, I guess. I like the always one damage mechanic this game has. I do too, I really do like that. Because it makes it so you can't just completely wall a spot infinitely. And there are some moments where the enemy is actually has perfect defense and you can't do any damage. So it's at least good you can do at least one damage to them. Exactly! Catcher dies here, can she not be recruited later? I'm pretty sure not. I don't know why she would be. I haven't encountered before, but I have had Valbar or Leon or Kamui die in that one chapter. They were not recruitable. Um, so I would assume the same would happen for these two. Leon, can you hit anyone? No. The heck? Can you kill this guy? No. What the heck? Saber, can you reach him? You can't have captured him. He wasn't standing there. All right, we'll do the same thing we did last time. Stab this guy. You know, this is going to last forever, isn't it? Because they're just going to keep running away. So we need we need to get more people over here, basically. Well, I hear chat axes are cheaper to make. Interesting. Well, then why does the Deliverance have some people with axes? Because they were kind of like really desperate for soldiers at one point. Saber, stand here. You can take some hits. And not not actually. Can you kill this guy? Go for it. What the heck? If I miss, I'll turn wheel. Thank you. Let me just move. Up. Let me just move in the way of one of your allies. It's all good, bro. <laughs> Yeah, totally. Good luck. Have you played Fire Emblem Warriors? I have not. It's it's the Warriors is not really my kind of game. Um So I, I I unfortunately no, I probably won't end up playing it. I've seen enough of it to know that okay, I can see what this whole game entails and uh, uh it, it it looks fun for those who like this sort of thing, but I'm not one of those unfortunately. Jenny has floofy hair. <laughs> Much floof. <laughs> Uh huh. And now they're both going for ca for Katri again. Shocker. She does have a high crit rate, luckily, but she's only gotten one crit this whole time. Hopefully, she runs away and runs away and heals. But knowing enemy AI, she'll go right towards their own fort to heal. Like, watch, watch what she'll do. Or no, she healed it from her ring. Never mind. Ooh, Pella's picking other people running away. Thanks, Pella. You're a real pal! <laughs> Violet mash button to murder your foes. FE Warriors. Yep, basically. Hellfire Emblem Heroes. I played, like, two maps. And then I was like, Yeah, this is fine. I just... I like real Fire Emblem more. So... And I don't really care for playing games on my phone all that much. I... I like, because... It's not like I'm... There's, there's any points in my life where I'm on the go and, oh, 
I am so bored, I want to just play a game on my phone. No, and I'm, I'm, the only times when I have a spare time are when I'm here at home, and I usually have all my other systems available to play. So. Uh. Oh, well you guys can talk. Sorry, I was going to have to wait. You have to move forward, Valbar. You have to attack this guy. Oh, oh, that was bad. Even for my standards. Oh, come on, SJX. It wasn't that bad. It was better than the axe jokes. <laughs> Hell, eh? Yes. It's a Smash Brothers game with Fire Emblem tape to it. Sure. 